Today, I'm going to show you three easy ways how to put text behind the objects. I'm sure most of you, if you work with CapCut, knows how to put text behind the human body. But what about behind the objects? For example, behind the animal or behind the mountains? It is not as difficult as it seems. Let me show you. First, let us put the text behind the person for those who struggle with that. Put your video on your timeline and go up to Cutout and Auto Cutout. We can use that because we have a person in the video and Auto Cutout works only with the human figures. Wait for process to finish, then drag your original video to the timeline. Drag it on the main timeline and put the cutout clip above it. Go up to text and add the default text. Write the text and choose the font you like. Make it bigger and turn the opacity all the way down and click on keyframe. Stretch the text to the length you want. Move your playhead to the point you see a person. Click on keyframe one more time. Go forward a little bit. Turn opacity to let's say 75 and keyframe will be created automatically. Now we just have to drag the text under our cutout clip and we get the end result. Let us move to our second tip and put the text behind the animal. Click plus icon to drop your video to the timeline. Copy the clip by holding Ctrl plus C or Command plus C and paste it with holding Ctrl plus V or Command plus V. Go up to Cutout and now we have to go to Customize and choose a smart brush. Then paint the animal, I have a nice bear here. And wait for process to end. When it's done, click on Apply. We can check our cutout if we click on this eye icon. Then go up and click text and add default text. Write your text. Resize it. And choose the font you like. I will also reduce the opacity to around 80. Stretch the text to the end of the video and drag it under our cutout clip. And there you go, we have a nice text behind our big bear. We can also put the text behind the mountain for example. We just have to follow the same process as we did with the previous video. Go to Cutout, Customize, choose Smart Brush. When it's done, click on Apply. Drag your original video down and swap it. Go up to Text, Add Text and write your text. Stretch it and drag it under the cutout clip. You can also right click on the text and make a compound clip. With your playhead on the beginning, go up and click on keyframe on position and size. Now move your playhead forward, resize the text, drag it to the left side and keyframe will be created automatically. And if we play it now, we have this nice floating text. I'm sure if you do that a couple of times, you will master putting text anywhere you want. I hope you liked this tutorial and if you did, don't forget to like and subscribe. Take care and see you in the next one.